Hi, my name is Robin Kelly, and I'm proud to be the executive director of FISH, Friends of the Issaquah Salmon Hatchery. Hi, my name is Cheryl Smith. I'm a mosaic artist with Cheryl Smith Mosaics out of Sammamish, Washington. The project that we're going to show you is something that we've created here at the hatchery to enhance the visitor's experience. So everyone knows that the hatchery hatches salmon, they spawn salmon, and we make sure that we have a healthy return. We teach about the environment and habitat, but we also realize besides the tens of thousands of people that come throughout the year and during the Salmon Days Festival, there are people that are visiting the hatchery site every day. And so during the months when the salmon aren't present, we'll have this beautiful piece of art for them to enjoy while they're visiting the property. Robin and the fish friends of the Issaquah Salmon Hatchery asked me to create a mosaic for the whole community. I was able to put together a project where 100 people within the community came together to create 87 mosaic recycled glass salmon that are on the wall that will be here to enhance the concrete as well as draw people back throughout the property so when the salmon are not here in the windows they can actually see something that's whimsical and fun and they can also be educated about the recycling aspect that we do here at the salmon hatchery. Most of the glass we used was recycled from local stained glass artists, the vendors as well as the manufacturers. We are very grateful to the Issaquah Arts Commission for putting together a grant to fund this project, as well as numerous manufacturers of the materials, as well as local glass vendors, such as Perry Stained Glass and Northwest Art Glass, who are very generous in donating their remnant glass. Here's a peek at Whimsical Mosaic Salmon Wall that you can see when you come to visit the salmon viewing windows. What's really great about this is many people of all ages and abilities created these unique salmon. We had kids come from Club Inclusive, a special needs group out of Issaquah High School. We had people that are volunteers here at the Salmon Hatchery, all the way up to into their late 80s. It was really exciting to see all the energy and the creativity that was put in all these unique salmon. Some of the people wanted to have them be more like the real salmon. So the people that are involved with fish, our docents and volunteers, worked really hard to make these fish appear the natural look or feel of the fish and they were very interested in the anatomical parts of the fish being accurate and then other people went the complete opposite direction and just had fun and used color and did whatever their heart felt. One exciting aspect about this project was the unique creativity that all the volunteers put into this. I gave them a lot of creative license when it came to the background and one of the fish volunteers love taking all of these orange bubbles and putting them at the bottom which represent the salmon row that you'll find when the salmon are here spawning. We also have these wonderful bubbles and colors and textures and it's something great that kids of all ages and adults can come in and it's a textural experience for them also. Most of the people that had created the salmon had never created a mosaic before. So I was able to teach them how to cut glass safely, to put together some whimsical colors and textures, and so they're able to create a unique salmon that's all their own. And as you can see when we're out at the wall, there are bright colors, it's a beautiful pattern with fun bubbles, it's very whimsical. It's for people of all ages to enjoy. And it's a priceless gift to the community because the community themselves made it. And we expect to see many of these people back visiting and showing off their proud salmon throughout the year and for many years to come.